What's up data people? My name is Matthew Heffron and today's quick tutorial is on top N and bottom N. So let's jump right into it. We're going to go to the sample superstore. Let's grab profit. We'll drop that on columns and we'll grab customer name, drop that on rows. And to clean this up, let's hold down our command key, click sum of profit. Let's drag that onto color and we'll also drag it onto label. And we'll right click customer name and let's go sort. And we're going to sort descending by field sum of profit. Hit OK. Now we have our top customers followed all the way by our bottom customers. So what if we want our users to be able to control this? We can do this with a parameter. So let's right click and say create parameter. And we'll give this a meaningful name. We'll call it top n integer 200 let's change the value to be up to 20 and then we'll say minimum one step size one hit OK and then let's right click that and we'll say duplicate and we're gonna edit this to be our bottom end and we can leave it with the same values let's hit OK so now once those are created let's right click show parameter control right click show parameter control and let's go ahead and hit this down caret and we'll say type in click here down caret type in that just makes it a little bit easier so we can just say let's see the bottom five let's see the top five maybe change the order of these but after we did that you can see nothing changed what do we have to do next we have to create a set. So let's right click customer name, create set. And this, let's give it a meaningful name, top n by parameter. So we'll go top by field. We wanna see the top, but not the top 10. We wanna see it by our parameter. So let's change this to top n, hit okay. Next, we'll right click that, duplicate, and edit set. This is going to be bottom. And then we'll change this from top to bottom and our parameter bottom end and hit OK. Let's go ahead and click bottom end by parameter. Hold down your command key and let's press top end by parameter. Then we'll right click and we'll say create combined set and we'll give this a meaningful name top n and bottom n and what we're doing is just combining the top five and the bottom five here we'll hit okay once we have that created we'll drop it on filters there you have it the top five customers and our bottom five customers and this is nice for our users because if they want to see the top 10 they can type that in and they can even see the bottom 10 if they wanted. Thanks for watching today's quick tutorial on top N and bottom N.